Welcome back to Round Top, Texas, and the Big Red Barn, the show that started it all here in Round Top. I'm Franz Helwig. I deal in American Brilliant Cut Glass. I'm in booth 371. If you see anything that you would like, please message me or uh, email me. Uh, if you would like larger pictures or have glass to sell, I buy rare pieces and whole collections. And again, this is video three, and we will begin with this 14 inch tray in Elmira's number 17 design. It's a fabulous large tray, excellent quality. Um, it's very rare to, I don't think I've ever seen a large tray by them. Um, and it's really a great deal at only $28.95. <clears throat> Excuse me, here we have some signed um, tall sh or hock champagnes, I guess they would be called. Uh, they're in hop diamond. And I have a set of six with the fluted stems and the starburst bases. They are $3.95 for the six. I've separated these in case someone only wanted to put a four or six piece set together or give as a gift. So this set is four of the same goblets and they're uh, only two sixty-five. Here we have um, a variety of silver overlay items. We've got a um, pinched decanter, nice sterling overlay, st sterling overlay stopper. Um, the sterling is marked 975 and 999 one hundredths, something like that. Or maybe the number, it's numbered 975 and then it says 999 one thousand. So anyway, it's only $2.55. There's a really nice rye design whiskey bottle. A nice clear blank, 11 and a half inches tall, and it's $245. And here's an array of little cups. Um, this one's taller than typical. Sterling overlay, $65. Um, this one's a double handled. That could have been used as a shot. It could have been used as a toothpick. It's 85. Um, here's a more elaborate sterling overlay with a monogram, and it is 55. And then the tray. I don't know if you can see the tray, but I'm also selling trays and plateaus now. And the tray is 95. Here's some really neat, I have a pair of these, they're Hertel Jacob Rahal, US Zone, Germany, white porcelain, silver overlay vases, they're 125 each. They have the, um, I was going to say inscription, they have the, tr the hallmark on the bottom, made in Bavarium, um, 125 each, and then here's a cute cobalt with sterling overlay and sterling stopper, miniature decanter, and it's in an equestrian theme, and it's only $155. Another whiskey bottle, um, it's got a cork stopper, a little bit simpler design, but the overlay is neat with a monogram, and it's $75. Here's two miniature decanters with sterling overlay. They are $95 a piece. They have sterling and cork stoppers. And then here's a lovely copper wheel engraved stem, very elaborate, elaborate rock crystal engraving, fluted stem with the colored knob above it, and then a starburst foot. I would think this is English. Um, I've not black lighted it because it doesn't matter. It's just great quality, and it's $6.95. And here's a five-piece set in Ellesmere by Libby. Yeah, they're all signed, of course. Probably some of the finest tumblers in cut glass. Great heavy pitcher, deeply cut, wide miters. Patterns shown in the red and gray catalog. Uh, the set is $24.95. And the um, tray with the gallery and the feet is uh, $125. You can buy the tray separately or you can buy the tray with 
be set. Here's um, two great wine stems. They're an olive green color. They're cut in clear button Russian. Has the St. Louis diamond stem, and then wonderfully, these have the colored scalloped pattern cut feet. And they're by Strauss, and they are $8.95 each, and I only have two. There's a great pair of sort of, I want to say teardrop, a pear shaped decanter is probably more appropriate. Uh, they're in Maryland by William Anderson. They're 11 and a quarter inches tall, four inches diameter. It's only $6.95 for the pair or $3.95 for a single. I'd hate to separate them, but I'm willing to. There's a cute Ray Laternos small engraved pitcher. Um, copper wheel engraving, beautiful butterfly, nice florals. Um, collection I got in uh, um, White Mills had a bunch of raised work. So this may be the last butterfly piece left. So it's five inches tall, four inches wide, and it's $95. It's a great trophy piece from my personal collection. It's a 1 1 rated Theodora pattern by Meriden. Great carafe. Probably the finest you'll ever see. Incredible Hobstar base. Great cane. Love the clear button. Hob stars, and then it's got a cross hatched collar on the neck. Impeccable quality, and it's $14.95. There's a set of uh, nine wine stems in Russian with the cross hatched buttons, um, St. Louis diamond stem, and a star cut foot. Uh, these are probably by Strauss, and it's $4.25 for all nine. And if you'd like to make a set, I have a great pair of decanters, the handle and unhandled versions in Russian. These have star cut hobs. Um, these are really brilliant in display. Heavy blanks, very fine quality. Triple diamond cut handle, and the pair is $24.95. Another 1 1 rated pattern is this Grecian uh, dessert set by Hawks. It's got the square roundish bowl. Great tusks. This is one of the most collected patterns in cut glass when I first came in and prior to that. Um, I find that Grecians getting a lot more attention again these days. The design is from the 1890s, early 1890s, and this makes quite an impressive set, and it is only $21.50. There's a cute signed Eggington Creswick pattern vase. Uh, my friend Ken Wolf who recently passed away found this for me. It's a very unique shape. It's shown exactly in their catalog. It's uh, 12 inches tall and it's 345. And this is the last of three violet vases in Cactus by Pearpoint. Nicely cut. It's shown on page 141 of their catalog and it is 225. And here's a set of 10 Monogrammed water goblets. They have an M on one of the flutes. They're all cut in heavy flute. Plain bases, but they're all signed Libby, so we know that they are Libby. Um, fluted teardrop stem, and the set of 10 is 650. It's a beautiful um, set of corset shaped colognes with great sterling stoppers. I think there's two other ones that I know of, and people told me that they're signed by Hawks, but I couldn't find a signature on these. Maybe the bases were polished or something from where. Uh, this is a great set, and it's only $8.95. Pairs of colognes are pretty collectible. There's a single tumbler in Ellesmere by Libby. Again, like I said, it's probably one of the best tumblers in cut glass, and it's $3.25. Um, here's a Sinclair Amber Bowl, uh, it's pattern number 40, has grapes engraved rim and then a sort of step cut uh, rectangular chain going around the sides, it's got a, a little wafer foot, nice rare color, uh, 10 inch diameter so it's good size and it's $5.95, that's a nice price. The perforated rim 
um, plateau or silver silver plate uh, tray, I should say. And you can put a decanter set, put a bowl in it. It's nice to add some variety in your display. And that's only 145. And we have a wide array of tumblers. They're usually very popular here. People like to drink their, sip their whiskey with them. There's a very elaborately cut tumbler and it's familiar, but I can't place it. Uh, lots of great cutting. It's 65. And the second tumbler, um, it's cut similar to like Wheeler or number 28, but, but it's definitely not. It's different. Uh, my first guess would have been Door Flinger, and it's only $20. Here's another tumbler. Um, it's a Venetia by Libby. Um, whenever it has the stars, we know it's Venetia. Pop stars in between, $55. There's a single tumbler in Alhambra by Meriden. It's 375, Hobstar base. And along with the Ellesmere tumbler, this is probably the other top tumbler in cut glass. <clears throat> and I have a bunch of these available. I picked up several collections and each had some. So if you wanted one, two, three, six, twelve, any amount, I can supply it. Here's a very unique. Um, punch cup, footed punch cup, and I'm not certain who did it, but th these are great. They have tiny Vesica hob stars and then clusters of tiny clear button hob stars. Uh, eight sided base, star cut, and those are 99 each. It's a great block design, all cut in stars, very deeply wide miters, um, deeply cut wide miters I should say, and it's 55. And here is Clark's um, Star and Diamond tumbler, uh, heavy, heavy blank, deep cutting, nice quality, $55. There's a single whore Monarch tumbler, great hob stars and vesicas, nice quality, it's only 30 and here's um, Acme by J. Hoare Water Goblets. They rival Wedgemere by Living. It's got the faceted knob with the teardrop, scalloped hop star foot, impeccable quality. Uh, some of the nicest water goblets you'll ever see that. I have two, six and three eighths inches tall, and they're 165 a piece. Here's the classic string holder by Hope Cut Glass. You can see where the string would come out of the top. Uh, cut in notched prisms, star base, and gorum sterling reticulated top, and it's $3.95. There's a neat little apple core stem, hollow um, teardrop in the center, star cut base. Very nicely cut. The pattern's familiar, but I can't place it. Oh, yeah, it's Argo by Empire. I forgot. All right, $65. And here's a set of six of the Alhambra tumblers um, by Meriden, and they are $21.95 for the set. And I do have a pitcher in Alhambra, triple diamond handle, Greek key repeats top and bottom, excellent condition teeth, which is rare to find. Uh, the pitcher is $24.95. And I would do a package deal if someone wanted to make a complete set, well, I'll give a discount for the set. Ruby cuts a clear wine stem, um, four and three quarter inches tall, um, just a chain of elongated punties, clear base, fluted petticoat stem, and it's 75. And that concludes video three from Round Top Texas. Um, thank you and stay tuned for video four.